Hey everyone and welcome back to the Board Game Spotlight. I'm Lizzie. I'm Derek. And today we are going to be playing Jurassic, Jurassic Parts, Parts from 25th Century Games. I'm so excited about this. Uh, when Chad reached out to us a couple months ago uh, to let us know that we were going to check it out, I, I was really happy because we just covered Fossilus. We had. And I know this is going to come up a lot because Fossilus was also a dinosaur digging bones game. It was. And we have... Jurassic Parts, mm -hmm. so inevitably the question will be, how similar are these, etc.? Not similar at all. Not at all. Two Completely entirely... different mechanics. I would say other than having a theme of dinosaur bones, they're right. very different. Which is get... funny that the same theme came out in the same year. Just not like with... Year, technically. Well, you're not. 2019, not 2020. But you know what I mean? Like, uh, we had Detective City of, uh, City of Angels, and Detective. they had Chronicles of Crime, and then Detective Chronicles, Modern yeah. Crime. So, like, even though they have the same theme... Totally different games. I mean, it happens in movies all the time, too. Like, you have movies that have the, the exact same thing, that theme, and they come out at the same time. And right. it's just... It's just weird. It's people, just, that's just how, that's how it works. that happen, and people make great games, and... Indeed they do. This is not at all similar to Falsus other than oh, you Digging didn't Bones. Wanna, you don't want to give me that bonus no, uh, on, the, start. <laughs> on the board? You Anyways, start thank you any. so much for joining us tonight. We're excited to show this to you. Um, as always, if you're watching on YouTube or Twitch or Facebook, we are happy that you're here. I see some new uh, faces. I see a lot of returning faces. I see Chad is in the comments over on Facebook. Uh, so thanks for being there. I'm sure he'll be like, no, 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 you can't do that. This is the way it works. And he'll make sure we're, we're straight. Um, but we're really excited. Um, I just got back from Pack South. It was a really great show. Uh, we had a lot of fun. The booth was crazy. Skybound was packed. We had fun showing off Sorcerer City and Wonderlands War and all, all sorts of our, our mm -hmm. games. Um, and then next week, no, yes, next weekend, Lizzie and I are going to be at Tantrum Con uh, in South Carolina. We'll actually see Chad there. We'll be yeah. hanging out with Tantrum Con and all sorts of fun people. So hopefully we'll get to see you there. So mm -hmm. if you're going to Tantrum Con, make sure you come say hi. We would love to play a game with you. Honestly, sit down at the table and we'll play something. Um, I know last year mm -hmm. we taught so many different games to people. Yes. Uh, just because we want to play more games. Yeah, and we'll <laughs> get to do our... Um, convention coverage like we did in the past. We'll walk around. We'll talk to all the booths that are there. To yeah. Look at all the games that people are going to be bringing. Should be a lot of fun. Yeah. And we haven't been able to do that recently. It's so true. It'll it's be true. nice to get back to that. We miss it. We're excited. Anyways, without further ado, let's dive down to the table and we'll take a look at Jurassic Parts. All right. So, so Jurassic Parts is an area control game. But instead of using meeples to control spots out there, you have chisels. Everyone starts with 12 chisels. Um, so on your turn, you're going to sharpen three of them. Yep. So since I'm starting, I will start with three sharpened chisels. And Derek gets an one. extra one. And then on his turn, he'll sharpen three. So his first turn, he will have four available. Yes. So as you can see, there are spaces throughout the board. Um, you are going to place these chisels out there. And you are trying to um, disconnect rock right. from the other rock so that you can claim them and use it. Some of them are face up, some of them are face down. You're going to try and complete dinosaur skeletons. Right. It's a game um, about area enclosure. Mm -hmm. So if you're familiar with Agricola and, and games where you have to build fences and stuff, mm -hmm. it's an area enclosure game. Also, I just want to mention the designer is Kevin Lansing, uh, who's also the designer of Flashpoint. Mm -hmm. uh, so a lot of people know that game as a fantastic cooperative game about putting out fires. And again, here, Kevin has worked his magic on a, uh, a really, another really great family weight game. Yes. Uh, we also have stones out there. Those cities are going to be a little bit more difficult to dig. So if there is a stone, you're going to have to spend two chisels, one to dig through the stone, it gets dulled, and you're going to place the second one. And if there's a spot with two stones, one on each side, oh you're going to spend three chisels, two to get through those stones, and then one will go in the middle. Okay. Um, so you're going to have three each turn. You don't have to place all three. You can hold over one per turn. Mm -hmm. So I could place two and save one for the next round. Um, so you're going to sharpen the three, three chisels to first move. You're going to play them. You can save one if you'd like. And then you can always um, transact with the field leader. So he is up here. Uh, you're going to earn amber throughout the game. So you can sell extra parts. Like if you don't need part of a dinosaur, you get a T-Rex part and you're like, eh, I'm not going to go after that. It's like four or five pieces. I don't right. want to spend the time. You can sell it to the field leader for an amber. Also, when you complete a dinosaur skeleton, you're going to earn amber. So you'll be um, earning this throughout the game. It's victory points at the end, but you can spend it to do special actions. So the field leader will let you um, ignore two chisel or er, the next two chisels ignore rocks, so you'd be able to place two chisels without having to spend extra. You can sharpen two chisels, which you can then use that round. Uh, you can take any of the fossils 
any one fossil from the field. So if you're like, man, I really need that T-Rex head. I'm not going to get it. You know, Derek looks like he's about to, you know, break the piece off. I don't think I'm going to get it. I'm going to spend one and I'm going to take it. You can also, um, extras will explain the divvying them up when we get when there in just happens. a minute. Yeah, it's just um, easier to do it But that some way. will end up at the field later. And if it has a part that you need, you can spend one to do it. So you, the first thing you do, it's going to cost one. If you want to take a second action from him, you're going to have to spend two amber. If you want to take a third action, you're going to have to spend three amber. So it's going to get a bit more expensive as you go along. Yep. Um, but that is a really cool thing that I love part of the game because last game I was able to buy some parts that it's I was going to get otherwise and, especially, and I finished them off. And, and that's a very important part because sometimes, and I can mm -hmm. see this happening in, in more of a three to four player mm -hmm. game where somebody digs and you weren't there yeah. and pieces get discarded that you really need to complete mm -hmm. a set. You're like, oh my gosh, you just go buy them from the field leader. Yes. It does cost amber, but yeah, again, there is some really nice things at play here. I'm really excited to get down into this. Jason Miller has um, joined and he's upset we did not wait for him. Oh, I'm sorry, so dude. sorry, Jason. Jason Miller on Facebook. I'm um, sorry that we didn't wait for you to start this. Uh, Helena Capel, hey, yeah. Helena, great to see you too. Uh, all right, so Lizzie, you're the first player. Well, I just want to show, these oh, are what we are going to be digging. First. So in the center here, if Derek will move. We have a wild bone, so that is wild. It can be anything. Uh, once it's placed, it becomes part of that skeleton, so even if you get the piece it was replacing, you can't swap it out. Uh, but you don't have to place it until the end of the game, so that's up to you. But there is a Brachiosaurus. Is it Brontosaurus? Yeah, it's a, bron it's a Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus, T-Rex, Velociraptor, Triceratops, and Pterodactyl. There's also two of those wild bones. And then there are plants, which are set, set collection, collection, which yep. are really cool. So that's what's under here. Some of them face up, some of them face down, and we're just gonna dive in. And when Let's we get to having a section cordoned off, we will explain how it gets to beat up because that's pretty cool. I love that part. I am in for it. <laughs> Man, so many difficult decisions though. I know, like where do you start, right? Yes, I know. I'm gonna make it count. Okay. I mean, go. yeah. One. I usually try to start where it's gonna be free. But yeah. also, it's not always that easy. Three. Great. Okay. Yeah. So I gotta so try to figure out up, what you're I gonna do here. Save. You're gonna so, try and figure it out. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to read your mind here. So I get three chisels myself. Good luck. Yeah. Okay. So the first chisel I'm going to place is going to be right here, hmm. and then I'm going to place another one here. Oh no. And then I'm going to place another one here. That right? Nope. Oh, almost. Not almost. Quite. I need one yeah, there. Yeah, I know. Oh, I thought you were going to do it. I was like, all right. Then I'm going to place one there. Okay, that's my turn. I don't have any amber at the moment, and uh, I used all my, my chisels up. Wow, you're really going to, like, force my hand. Of course I am. Also, you don't have to place your chisels one off of each other. You can spread oh, yeah, them can around the board. Um, but uh -huh. in a two-player game, I, I kind of feel like it's you more important it to get a good together. line in. together, yeah. yeah. Now, in a three- or four-player game, when you're reacting to so yeah. many players placing on the board, you'll want to maybe, you know, make sure you at least get one uh, of the chisels onto another person's line. Because if they end up, you know, digging, mm -hmm. and you're not there mm -hmm. to at least get a tile, whew, my goodness. That's a lot, yeah. Yeah, that could be, that could be rough. There is a wild bone. Yes, Jason, that is exactly what we said. Wild bones. Uh, Games of Fire over on YouTube said that uh, not <laughs> this playthrough is not good for their wallet book. Uh, <laughs> okay. They watched the uh, Rurik playthrough and had to buy it. That was a so, good one. That was a really, really good one. That was a great one. one. Uh, we actually just recorded our top 10 of 2019. And spoilers, Rurik f is in there somewhere. Somewhere in, in, in the top, top 10. That's it's all okay. we're going to say, though. So you're just going to have to wait lips until it comes out. I see you. All right. I'm okay. going to get three myself. Now, you are limited with chisels, which means you can't just yes. spread yourself You can't just keep putting them out, putting them out. And then uh, if you get to the point where you don't have any chisels in your dull side to take mm -hmm. out, you have to take back from the board. Okay. Place. So we're going to go ahead and start this. We're going to get this party started. I'm going to do one here. And then I'm going to spend two to go ahead and break this off. Okay. So immediately this will so flip. These come over. These are the three. So we have a Tyrannosaurus. No, that'd be a T-Rex. T-Rex, Brachiosaurus, and a plant. No, that is a Triceratops. It's T-R. Oh, it is T-R. And a plant. That's right. That's right. Um, T -rex interesting. T-Rex is T-Y. It's very and there's three. And so I you're going to get two. Two, and you're going to get one. So when you divide it up, whoever has the majority, which would be Derek in this case, he takes half, round it up. So in three, he's going to take two. I would take the leftover one. Um, if it was five, he would take three. I would get one because there would be two left over, and then the yep. one would go to the field leader. 
So that's where that um, comes in. I, I don't get an amber because I've not completed mm -hmm. a, a dinosaur, but all of these come off the board now mm -hmm. and return to our reserves. So that's how you're going to get them back because nothing ever stays on the edge. It always has to be between at least two. Right. So like this would be not be an illegal placement because there's nothing on the other side. All right. I think it's your turn. Okay. So I'm going to take three. <laughs> and Jason says Rurik and 37 other games. Now, I, I will have you know that I actually got down it to was 10 with, this year. <laughs> it was because it was with two, three other people. And so we all voted <laughs> and we made a top 10. It was not Derek's personal uh, top 10. That's fair. Which it's... is not usually 10. Okay. Um, that's fair. Oh, yeah. Scotty Cross on Facebook. He just got here. So he wants us hey. to start over. <laughs> you know what, Scotty? Just come over. We'll teach you. Yeah, come on over. Uh, turn order. Sharpen chisels, place chisels, uh, save a chisel. If you'd like. Yeah. I'm going to save a chisel. Oh my gosh. You are, are you, are we really doing this right now? I don't know. Are you? Oh my gosh. You got to be kidding me right now. Am I? Hold on. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, right? Mm -hmm. You'll get half. You'll get, get four, four and I'll get two. I'll get two. And then two will go to the field later. <sighs> I'm not going to lie. That's pretty good value for me because even if you put another one down there, you're still, it doesn't change anything. It doesn't change how many you get. Yeah. I'm actually okay with those odds. So I'm going to take three chisels and I'm going to come over here. So I did all the work. Yeah. And he's still going to get a pretty good benefit. Pretty much. Go over That's here. That's the thing in the game. In a two player game, it's much more about Put trying here. to balance how much work you're doing with the other player exactly you want to do enough to where you're going to get a really good reward but you don't want to waste it like <laughs> i just did i just did all that work and derek's still going to get a bunch right now here's the thing you yeah. could leave it sit there for a while and, I could. and not finish it out I could. but it's true i'm willing to to take the he's chance. willing to bet that i'm going to do it right now because <laughs> shockingly i am because i want to get some of this stuff okay so it's going to oh, take two chisels so this one will come back here um so as soon as a section has been sectioned off you reveal anything that's flipped over and you do it so i still right. have a couple more that i will play on my turn um ooh, it's pretty good so i'm gonna take pretty one nice. two no leave me the plant you don't want plants three nope nope four nope. Ah, okay so i had that's so good two pterodactyls so those are each completed skeletons so they each will earn one so good so i'm gonna take those i get a plant I got a Triceratops skull right. and then the two pterodactyls. I'll go ahead and just take the completed Velociraptors to get my own um, amber, please. Okay. Thank you. So all of these are going to come yep. off. Well, that's good because I get all of mine back. And you still have uh, two to use for your turn. I do. So I can continue. Yes, you can. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> this guy says, look at that Quackalope shirt. Where's Jesse? I'm sure Jesse will be here. As soon as you mention Quackalope, he tends to uh, pop up to pop pop in somewhere. Okay, I'm going to place those there. Okay. Uh, are you going to use your amber? Because that's one thing you can transact at the end of your turn with the uh, field leader. I would not like to at this moment. Thank okay. you. I'm going to go ahead and get three chisels myself. Oh, and we didn't mention... Um, we are also playing with the item cards. Mm -hmm. uh, these are one-time use cards that you're going to be given at the end of the game or at the beginning of the game, and you can choose to use them on your turn uh, as you see fit. So each of us has two of these we can use. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so I just wanted to, to make that note. Yeah, so um, that is a uh, advanced setup. You know, we thought it is. We can handle it. So I'm going to place one here by spending two, and then I'll place one here. All right. Mm -hmm. And I have one of these. I will. What's up there? We've got the Tyrannosaurus I Rex. I think they're both two Yeah. Yes. And there are. I'll do that. Two. Give me the. Can I have the T Rex? The... Yeah. Which one? Oh, uh, the head. The I head. Want the head. Yeah. Okay. Actually, I don't know where his tail is, and his head is here. So give me, give me the tail. That way I can kind of like watch. Well then. Watch yes. where that's at. So there are two Triceratops in the game, two T-Rex, three Velociraptors, two Brachiosaurus, and five Pterodactyls. Five Pterodactyls. Like whole Pterodactyls. Yeah, like whole yeah. sets. Yep. Um, so I'm going to take my three. <laughs> it's an evil laugh. It is an evil laugh because one, two, it's a tie, and the player whose turn it is decides <laughs> ties. Wow. You forgot to tell me that rule. 
Did you I? forgot to tell me that rule. I'm not gonna lie. You you, <gasps> you did. Ooh, wow. them wild bones. The wild bones. Are dealt, so are there's there one, wild two, three, four, five, six. No. So I am gonna take. So it's take... three and three, right? Or is it three and two? Three and then two. And then I get two. Yeah. So I'm gonna take two plants and a well, wild. I'll tell you what. Getting the Tyrannosaurus uh, legs was a good, a good. Derek's idea. not mad about that. I'm not. And then I'll go ahead and take another Velociraptor, because Velociraptors are awesome. Why would I not want that? Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't mention this before, but my character's name... Oh, now you're name... just making up more rules. <laughs> really? What's your character's name? Oh, yeah, we didn't Dr. Talk about Naomi him. Grant. And I am Dr. Malcolm Stone. Which I just love. It's fantastic. <laughs> it makes me so Andrew happy. Andrew Bosley is doing oh, art yes. for this game. And uh, I would highly encourage everyone to go check out the Kickstarter page to see how gorgeous it is. Um, I mean, you can you can see how how awesome it is just based off of our player boards. Like, here's one of the characters. But honestly, you'll get a better feel when you go look at the, the Kickstarter yes. page. So we are Dr. Grant and Dr. Malcolm. That seems... Uh, I've heard those names before. Yep. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. All right. Take me back to my childhood. I was a huge... Is it my turn? Or are you yep. going to transact with I'm the uh, field leader? Oh, I had one. No, I put it out there. I'm not going to transact with the field leader. There's nothing I would like to do at the moment. Wow. But... Just snubbing the field leader. Goodness. I, I see. Let's I'm put just these biding my time. Down over here so we can kind of see them a little better. Jason says Velociraptors are the Steve Urkel of the dinosaur community. Wow. I'm going to go one, two... Three, four. Oh wait, yeah, I had four to spend. I'm good. I'm good. Do you have an amber? Do you want to do anything? No, I've Are spent my amber. I'm good. You spent your amber. Yes, I did. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna take three. Oh man. What? Let's put one there, and I'm gonna spend two to go here. So I can't let you be over there by yourself. <laughs> I mean, you can. That can't. was the plan. I, I wanted that to happen, but it's okay. No. I'll allow you to be over there. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, and uh, so Chad mentioned this over mm -hmm. on Facebook, uh, and I really like this. He said that the these cards, tool the cards? item, the tool cards are essentially asymmetric powers. So rather than attach them to a player board, they're randomly dealt mm -hmm. out, um, which is cool because you might want to play a character based on how they look or, or the color, or the color, and then not you be get your locked own into totally. always having to use some power that maybe is not best for your playing style. Because totally. that happens sometimes where I'll be like, oh, I'm playing blue, yeah, absolutely, and then I don't like the player power, and I'm One, like, two, well, three, four, five, six, color is more important than player power for me. So I'm going to go ahead and spend, dang. So no matter if I go here or you go there, I'm still getting the majority. So, yeah, so you're still getting three. I would, I'm and gonna I would go get two. Here, I'm going to go here. And then I'm going to go here. No. Here. Okay, mm -hmm. your turn. Hmm. I will go here first. Okay. We're gonna flip these right. over. So We're you're gonna, gonna get these. three. Okay. So I'm gonna take the plant, the Brachiosaurus head, and the Brachiosaurus. Oh, but there's the T Rex. No, that's Triceratops. Oh, that is. T R is Tri. Yeah, T R. No, I need the Brachiosaurus stuff. I need the Brachiosaurus junk. So I'm gonna get two. I'm gonna take the Triceratops, which is going to complete a Triceratops for me. Whoa! Look at which you. Which gives me an amber. And then whoa, whoa, I whoa. will take the Triceratops skull. So I need the two um, And I'm actually going to sell the Triter Triceratops skull because I don't really need it right now. Um, and I'm going to take an amber for doing that. So that's one of the things that you can do. Okay. Um, it's on your board. On your turn, sell, you may sell any one fossil to the field leader for one amber. Right. Um, and then it's still my turn, so I still have two chisels. Mm hmm That I will... You'll choose to spend. Will I? I don't know. Are you going to? You tell me. Mm -hmm. Oh, these all come off. Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, I'm going to place this here, and I'm going to hold one over. Okay. Are you going to transact with the field leader? Um, no. Okay. So I'm gonna go one, two, three. Oh, you think you're gonna cut me out, huh? Uh, I'm I'm trying. 
<laughs> so I'm gonna take three? <laughs> yeah. That was the plan. We'll see if it works or not. I'm gonna spend an amber to sharpen two chisels. Ooh, sneaky, sneaky. So it costs two to go here. Right here? Uh -huh. Okay. One to go here? Yep. And then two and to go two there? Two to go nice. here? Okay, so, so I've got majority. This gets flipped over, so you're gonna get so two. So I get two. I'm taking both Brachiosaurus. I'm taking the, that one to get me an amber. Bum, bum, bum. And this will go up here. I finished um, the Brachiosaurus, get, which gives me an amber. I still have one left over. What do I want to do? Those are yours. So I was upstairs throwing things all over his room. <laughs> he's like, how dare you play this game? I know how fun I it know. is. Seb loves dinosaurs, and then he's probably upstairs. Just he's mad at us. Randomly throwing stuff all over the place. I love how the board shrinks. Yes. And then it like the tension really starts okay. to ramp up because you don't want to get cut out of things. You're like, no, 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 not yet, not yet. It's like, how dare you? Uh. Okay, so I've got that. I'm gonna go here. You finished the brachiosaurus. Yes, did I did. I miss that? You did. <sighs> you sure did. One here, and one here. I gotta take three. Hold on. Nope. nope. I, I get to transact at the end of my turn. That's not my I fault. I wasn't like nah, rushing nah, 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 you. Nah, nah, nah. I was just gonna take three. Can I see what the field leader has? No. Let's see if I want to buy something from him. The field leader doesn't have a name though. I feel like the field leader needs to have a name. Oh, maybe a community project. Yeah, that that sounds like a really good uh, community community it's thing to no do. Spared no expense. Uh, I'm gonna buy the T Rex head. Are you? I am. It Are you? It happened. Thanks. Uh. Thanks, Dr. Uh, oh, okay. Okay, Felix. now are you done? Know. Yeah. I'm going to take three. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm going to do... Oh, Jason's here. What up? We've been talking... Oh, Jason. Jason Mohan. Mohan. Okay. From Big Kid Games. One, two. There. And then one. So this uh, gets, let's see. Oh, Glenn is over in Illinois on YouTube. Asked what game this is. This is Jurassic Parts. Uh, this is a game that is currently live on Kickstarter as of today, mm -hmm. and uh, it is a family weight game of area enclosure and digging up dinosaur bones. Okay, so one, what did I miss here? You're getting there are five, and you're two, getting three, I get three yep. and I get one. Three. Yep. I'm gonna sell this for amber. I don't amber. want any of that stuff. So I'm selling it. Amber for that. I'm selling it for amber. And this Velociraptor is mine. Okay, so hang on, it is still my turn. Is there? Actually, I can't sell that on your turn. Nope, it says you on my turn, yep. so I'll, I'll keep it. That yeah, is no. not what I want. Okay, um, let's take all of our chisels back. They are dull now and of no use to anybody until it's we true. sharpen them back up again. They've been used. Is it my turn? Um. Why do you have so much amber? Ah ha ha! I am going to pay one to take any fossil from the field. So I'm going to pay mm -hmm. one, take the Velociraptor oh, to finish this Velociraptor. Which gives you another amber. Give me another amber. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, I am well done, done now. All right. Take ch uh, chisel. Man, I keep doing this. One, two, uh, three. Mm-hmm. And then I'll spin this to uh, sharpen two more chisels. And I'll go, how does this work? We've got an island. So like. That separates it out. Yeah, but that well. One, oh yeah, that would that, separate this that one. That would not, yeah, that would separate that one. It would just be those two. It would be these two? So you get one. I get one of these two? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna take the plant. Okay. That goes back to the field leader. Mm -hmm. And then these come back to my supply. Yep. And, and then still I still have one, and we're gonna go right here. Okay, okay. your turn. Okay. Oh, hold on. Nope, stop. I'm selling. Sorry, I'm selling for an amber. Mm -hmm. You can sell once per turn. Because I don't. I mean, I don't. I'm, there's no way I can finish a second brachiosaurus, and I don't need that. That brachiosaurus tail. As cool as it is. Mm -hmm. Hey, Brandy, uh, Brandy Marie Cord over on Facebook. Uh, it was really nice to meet you at Gen Con. That was fun. Okay, so I'm gonna take three. Let me look through. No, okay. I'm gonna do one here. 
and two to do this, uh -huh. which is going to make the, oh no. No, it's not. It's gonna separate these though. You so just, one, two, three, four. Wait, what is it gonna do? Oh yeah, it so separates these. these four, and these I, I have three to your one. So I'm still gonna get one so out I of that. I am totally okay with two. that. Two, so I'm gonna take this and the plant. And I'm gonna take the Velociraptor, uh -huh. which so finishes uh, this. So hang on. One. Well, I still get my amber for finishing the dinosaur. Okay, okay hang on now. Okay, I'm going to, I'm gonna buy a couple things, I think. And remember, so the first the first transaction you do with the field leader costs one amber. If you do a second transaction, it costs two, and then a third transaction costs three. You can only do up to three transactions with uh, the field leader. Okay. So I'm gonna buy both of these, but I'm going to use the government grant, reduce the transaction costs with the field leader field leader by one amber minimum of one. So the first one's gonna cost one, and then the second one is also gonna cost one by nice. using this. So I'm gonna take It's these. a good one. It is a good one. So I have most of a T-Rex. Sweet. Let me know when it's my turn. It is your turn. Cool, I'm gonna sharpen my chisels. Uh, well, I'm obviously gonna place, well, actually, yeah. I'm gonna spend two to just, <gasps> So you get to pick which get, side you want. Oh, yes, sir. Because they're both sir. equal. So you can take. I'm going to do this one. Yes! Yes! That was perfect. Oh, that was perfect. Okay. I just finished my T-Rex. So oh, man. Do an amber? I am totally, totally okay, doing well. These all come So off. happy. Hold on. I still had one chisel left. Okay. But you just put that in there. Because I only spent one to do that. Mm -hmm. um, so this is going to go up here. Mm -hmm. Then my last chisel. I'm, oh, I can't place it, so I'll hold it over. Oh my gosh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not doing Transact anything. with the leader, I'm gonna buy. Are T-Rex feet in here somewhere? I hope so. No, no, yeah. Oh wait, I already used that in the wild, sorry. So once you've assigned that yet, you can't change it's fine. anything. It's fine, So you're gonna buy that? Gonna buy this. For and one? then guess what? Yeah, I already spent the one. Government grant, do it again. To buy the back? To buy the back. To get your amber back? To get my amber back. I think okay. I finally found a game I'm good at. And I'm gonna hold that chisel over, and it's your turn. Okay. Well, I get three. Oh, man. So I'm gonna do... <laughs> I'm gonna do... One, two, to go here. She'll flip this and give it to me. So it's a pterodactyl, yes! That gives me one point, or one amber. Um, and this comes back. And then I think I'm gonna spend Are you just gonna close an it amber out? to get two chisels. So one, two, three. So yeah. I'll go here. Uh, so this will flip over. And I get to pick one or the other. So I'm gonna take the plants. This will go up here. Works, goes up there. This goes here. I will use this Wild while bone. to finish off my T-Rex. Your T-Rex doesn't have a face. It just has oh wild Oh my bones. gosh! <laughs> okay, so go ahead. Our child got out of his room, which He's has never, never happened done before. That before. I'm gonna let you finish. Hi, Sebastian. Okay, okay. I didn't know he could open the door. Okay, okay. It's a new thing. Okay, come here. He can help us score. We're at scoring. I totally okay. apologize okay. for that. Okay. Yeah, come on. Can you be quiet though? Okay, come here. Okay. Okay. All right. Sorry about that, guys. He has childproof, um, like the ch the childproof door handle thing. So he's either figured it out. This Which is like that he's scene. He's not in supposed the movie. to be able to get out. Okay. So it's like the Velociraptor okay. scene. All right. So ready? in game scoring, we're gonna score our t our dinosaurs. So Lizzie has. Let's do plants first. Yeah, so plants are. I'll let plants. you hold the plants when when I'm do done. I have five. Five. <laughs> five. You have five plants. So, so that's gonna 11 give you eleven points. points. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Hold on, I'm 15. doing your pterodactyls. I know. So 11, 12, 12 13, 13, 14, 15, 15 16. 16. 16. Okay, so let's pause there. Sebastian, okay. you can hold mommy 16 points. There you go. Thank you. All right, so 16 for you plus a T Rex. Is, 20, is 10? Is, is 10 for 26. So 26. Triceratops. Triceratops gives you seven, so 31, right? 26 six. and 6? No. No, 32. 36 and 6. And then a Velociraptor is another, so on top of 32 is 4. So 36, 36. points. 
Scooter's And then seven, each amber is a victory point at the end. 39, 40, 41. 41. Cool. Please. Okay, so I have one, two, three. Oh, oh, I guess I can move these in the center high here. High high. So one, two, three Are you plants. On mommy's team? Five points. It's the best team to be on. Uh, a tr uh, Triceratops gives me seven, so that's uh, seven plus five, seven, twelve. Uh, so I scored that. Are you waving at everyone? So I'm at 12. I'm going to do this. Hi. 13, 14. Uh, Velociraptor is 4, 16. Oh, Another one is 20. TT. Oh, 20 plus uh, a T-Rex yeah. is 30. Plus a Brachiosaurus is 15 for 45 ah. points. Yeah! Daddy won. Daddy oh. won. Yeah. Yes. 45 to 41. So four point difference. That's much better than the last dinosaur game we played. Uh, yeah, it's true. The fossil is you wiped the floor with me. I did, but they oh, um, amended some of the scoring so that that wouldn't happen again. Absolutely. I kind of broke it a little. You did break it a little bit. But anyways, thank you so much for joining us tonight. That's how you play Jurassic Parts. Again, it plays two to four players, I believe. Um, we'll look at two, here. Four, I also saw... uh, two to four, 30 to 45 minutes. Yeah. Andrew Bossley Art. Kevin Lansing is the designer, and uh, 25th Century is the publisher. So you can go uh, to, in the description, somewhere around all over the place, you can go to a link to yeah, their the Kickstarter, Kickstarter page. It launched today, so they're about 70%. They're doing fantastic, so go help them out, and then we can unlock some stretch goals. This game is so much fun. It's a very um, simple take on area control, so for sure. it's really great, for sure. easy to grasp for um, kids, families, it's competitive enough that and adults are going to enjoy it. And it's got dinosaur bones. And it's got some great uh, punny, sneak peeky things for those who are dinosaur, dinosaur fans. Yes, sir. absolutely. It is a dinosaur. And I absolutely he knew the dinos were here. <laughs> I absolutely love the. Uh, I just want to show these yes. off. Chad and the team did an awesome job at being inclusive of mm -hmm. many different uh, well, people. Andrew Bosley. Andrew Bosley did the art. Did so the art. Did so you've got job. all sorts of different body types mm -hmm. um and um ages and nationalities. and nationalities and so i just i really really appreciate mm -hmm. appreciate that look uh so anyways are we saying bye is it time to say bye 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 he's got his little like pad and wave down so sorry for the little bit of the interruption but sub just heard yeah. how much fun hey. we were having can you say bye to everybody Bye-bye. <laughs> Go check it out on Kickstarter. We'll see you back here tomorrow night for Atlanta's Rising. Bye, everybody.